So we're out on a beautiful, misty, sunny morning. And our plan is to hit the cattail swamp over here and have a look for some geese. Goose season just opened uh, four days ago. We've got our fishing rods too, so we're just drawing a few casts here. It's a very likely pike spot. And we brought a frog spear. So we're going to look for bullfrogs because uh, I heard a lot of them calling here earlier in the season before the uh, season for them opened. And we might have a little poke around for some wild rice, some swamp milkweed, some high bush cranberry. Uh, the wild raisins are starting to get ripe. So we got lots of lots of possibilities. And we'll see if any of them pan out. Just uh, throwing this cyclops around. Daphne's got a blue and white spoon. Let's see what happens. Let's see who catches the first fish. Daphne just gave me a look like, of course it's going to be me. No? I don't know what look that is. So Daphne is picking some of the seed heads of the uh, pickerel weed. We harvested some last year, but we didn't do anything with it, right? Just like a little handful as an experiment. They're, they might still be in my kitchen. So we think what you need to do is to leave them sit in water so that the seeds come out of the uh, seed pods. But maybe if you know, you could let us know in the comments. That's what we're going to try anyway. We'll see how it goes. Muskrat house or just a hangout? Oh yeah. So it's maybe just a hangout on top of the log. Something's been eating up there yeah, though, eh? Clamshells. Yeah. Some seed heads. Yeah. From some sedges. And then you see the big spiky balls by your paddle. Like right against your paddle shaft. Yeah. I don't remember what those are. I looked them up one time. Something. Look them up later. What's that? Don't fall in. So this is the swoop. Swamp milkweed, which is reputed to have stronger fiber than the regular milkweed. He's going to pick some. I still didn't hear you, babe. Oh, I just said you were going to pick some. Oh. And then you did. Right on cue. So we'll have a closer look at that later. Dolphin is picking nanny berries or wild raisins. Are they good? Mm-hmm. 
you want a couple? Sure. Thanks. Lunch time. Today is day 248 of big wild year. So we have a wild lunch here. I'm trying to reach around the camera. So I did some pressure canned pike and I think there's a little bit of fat and a little bit of salt in there. So I'll pass one up to you. Pressure can bike. Give it a little try and see how it is. So we saw a flock of geese go by really high. Tried to call them in, but no luck. We saw lots of ducks. They open up in two weeks, week and a half. And we got a snail and half a bucket <laughs> of pickerel weed. Okay, there's swamp milkweed. Okay. Some nanny berries and swamp milkweed. Oh yeah, nanny berries and swamp milkweed. How's your pike? Yeah, you like it? Mine's alright, but it needs a bit of flavor, I think. Pack the salt? I didn't pack any salt. Where's the little container I took to your parents' place last Probably still there. Hmm. So we'll have our lunch and then we'll do a little bit of fishing on our way back. Stuff time. Moose roast, wild mushrooms. That looks good. Some wild rice and then I'll just show you a couple of other things so we picked some more nanny berries or wild raisins so we're gonna cook those and then run them through my food strainer and we're gonna cook a cake with them and some wild rice flour and down here is most of the uh, wild buckwheat that we picked when we were picking acorns um, so this is a, an invasive plant in North America, uh, but it has a, a pretty large seed. We've never worked with this before, so this is experimental, but we picked a fair amount of it. And I'm just drying it out. And we'll do something with it later. So these have been on the stove for about an hour, just kind of simmering away. These, there's less than a liter of nanny berries there, I guess. And they're going into the hopper hot. Following Sam Thayer's method. He has a chapter on this wild edible. This is my Victorio food strainer. So I put the uh, larger than normal strainer on it. And, oops. I'm gonna run these guys through. hard to run through and then the other trick is it's hard to hold on to this when you put hot stuff through because it heats up really fast I think it's gonna be all right though thank you so the mush comes out the middle and some of the juices from it straining and then you just get a bear poop out the other end so 
So when it's done, which it pretty much is now, we'll just uh, scrape down the mush that's still hanging onto the strainer. We'll go around it with a spatula or something. And then all that mush goes into our cake. Alright, so the mush is in here and the dry stuff is the rice flour. I dumped in some bear fat and a little splash of maple syrup. And it's not gonna it's gonna be a bit drier than we want because the rice soaks up a lot of liquid. So we're gonna add a little bit of water to this. And then it's going in the oven at about 375 or 400. And then uh, we'll uh, cook it for about 20 minutes or so, eh? So my daughter's playing music in the background, which means that my video is gonna get flagged. And I'll have to send royalties to, who is that? The weekend? Oh well, a little bit of water. So here's that pickle weed. And I think what you need to do, I think I read this somewhere, is to uh, soak it and let the seeds fall out of the little pods. And for that, I've got this kiddie pool. So, I'm just gonna put this in here. And then I've got a few barrels of rainwater that I'll dump in there. And I'll just keep an eye on it over the next few days or weeks. Dolphy's complaining that there's no berries. <laughs> I'm not complaining, I was surprised. Yeah. It smells really good. Let's have a little taste test. Okay. So, nanny berries, wild rice, bear fat, maple syrup. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's all right. I think, uh, I think some of the seeds got ground through. Maybe that's what that little bit of bitter is. Mm, I'm not getting any bitter. Maybe you just got one. There's nothing wrong with that. I'd do it again. So yes, please. There, we added berries. We're gonna eat it like that. <laughs>